people of the world. Okay. Now, we're testing out something new. Let's go over here to Vibe. Actually, hold on. Let's go to the Discord screen. Um, I'm testing out a uh, feature that I've been... Uh, had my eye on for a while which is called the uh it's like a stage basically setting up like a stage a live stage in the discord mic check one two okay so uh as far as i understand this allows for us to have a structured conversation i've got the link if you want to join this it's it's if you're already a part of the armor garden uh uh what's it called uh discord the regular discord then you should be able to uh connect to it no problem it's just a different room so instead of going to live voices you guys would go to live panel and this allows me to have like a uh, like a panel discussion where i can pull people up onto the panel and then like put people back down into the audience if people just want to listen so um i'm testing out the feature seeing how it goes and uh yeah maybe we can experiment with that what's up abe what's up spoolie <laughs> You knew today was going to be a great day. Heck yeah. So, uh, so yeah, yeah, yeah. How's everybody doing? How you mamming them? Um, I've got Minecraft in the background here. Um, but I'm kind of just down to play whatever. So, uh, I think we'll start with that. And, uh, we'll see. We'll see how this goes. I'm testing out like multiple different new things today. So, uh, I also have an awesome feature now where I can clip um i can now clip the streams live right whatever's happening and i can get a a vertical clip i have like basically separate scenes set up so it's super 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 tight bro what's going on don don i saw you message me uh this is what don messaged me he goes i can't hear shit <laughs> he goes he goes i can't hear shit in the listening thing of discord <laughs> um yeah because well don that's because uh i was muted and uh getting ready to go live so i got it set up now though and and that's what it is so uh it'll it'll be it'll be useful when we get uh folks in here ready to have a conversation you know depending on what we're we're doing and talking about it'll allow for that without it being uh a shit show or less of a shit show we still kind of want it to be a shit show but less of a shit show than it would be otherwise. <laughs> uh, more structured conversation, shit like that. So, whoa, that was super lag. What's going on, Red Sky? Did you say praise be? Why does it feel like I'm getting? Why does it feel like I'm getting frame drops all week? How's the how's the how's the video feed look to you guys? Does it look smooth? It looks kind of choppy on my screen. Encoding encoding overloaded. <laughs> uh oh. Rot roll. It's choppy. Okay. Well, shit. Okay, hold on. Yeah, this is why I wanted to test this. Um, what can I do here? What can I do? Chopped and screwed up. Like it looks okay now, but every once, yeah, see, it just kind of gets choppy for some reason. Consider turning down video settings or using a faster encoding preset. Oh, that could be it too. What is my preset? Actually, I think it's probably this. General, uh, let's see. Resolution. Let's turn that off for now. See if that helps. Huh. 
What's up, Don? Yeah, you seen that? So there's a lot of shit going on in the world, you guys. A whole lot, a whole lot of things. For example, um, for example, uh, have you guys heard about Ohio? I guess Ohio's having like a full-on ecological disaster that nobody's really talking about. I was like, what the shit is happening here? Had to dig, had to do some digging to find out like what was actually happening. There was like a train derailment. A train derailed, right? And it had all kinds of like toxic chemicals on it or whatever. And they had to burn it as opposed to letting it explode. If I'm understanding things correctly. And so all this toxic shit is like all over the place in Ohio or whatever. I don't know. I want to, I want to learn more about it. I just, I was hearing about it. I was like, what the fuck? Yeah, let's talk about it, Don. Let's talk about it. <laughs> I mean, I, I don't, I don't really know much more than that. It's like, uh, I don't know. Like, there was that, but there was also the all the different blimp shit that was going on. So we had all these different blimps or whatever, whatever unidentified uh, aerial vehicles uh, or unidentified flying objects, as it were, right? And then and then there was this this shit with, uh, you know, with with Ohio or whatever. And I'm like, it's just like too much happening, dude. Too much happening all at once for me to keep track of it. And that's always the case. Like monitoring my feeds and I'm trying to see what the hell's going on. I'm like, what? What? You what? So, uh, so how's the feed? The feed seems to be better now. I think it's, I'm going to have to figure out what settings I can use with this supplemental view here that I have. Because when I hit clip... I want it to be able to clip both. I bet you I could knock it down to 30 frames per second and that would probably help. That's probably what I'll do. We don't need 60 FPS. Although it's, it is kind of nice. Hi there, Nikki. Our distant relatives, the aliens, are disappointed in us on how we treat Mother Earth. So they're coming around to let us know they're... <laughs> hold on. They're coming around to let us know... Uh, shit, shit, shit. Hold on. Um, to let us know that they're not happy, right? <laughs> who knows? We might be leaving with them soon. I, you know, that would be great. <laughs> I mean, probably. Uh, Abe said it's the material they used to make plastic. Um, Abe says, follow me for more info. Yeah, no, it, what was the actual, what was the actual chemical? Um, let me look at it. It was like, uh, it's what they used to make like PVC or a certain type of PVC, which is in like everything. And, uh, the problem is they, they ship it in like, I, I was watching the, there was like a dude on TikTok who, who broke it down. He's like an engineer and he broke it down. And, uh, he was talking about the various chemicals. You guys have probably seen the video if you're on TikTok anyway. So, uh, if not, um, I know that I know that I saw the link to it on Twitter. Um, so you could probably find it if you searched for it. Um, let me see if I can find the chemical. Okay, so vinyl chloride. It's called vinyl chloride. And it apparently has now contaminated the Ohio River. And I don't know, like, yeah, so it's crazy. Vinyl chloride. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dr. Boom, you know, you know what it is. You know what it is. So yeah, I've been I've been monitoring that and trying to follow everything else crazy that's going on in the world. Cause there's so much now. So much to try to keep up with. Red Sky says beam me up. That's what I'm talking about. Let me out of here. <laughs> Let me out of here. The show. The show, what? Montel Williams with Sylvia Brown. Yes, I remember. <laughs> Sylvia Brown. Who could forget Sylvia Brown? Rip, by the way. Our homes will be made of plastic? Nah. In 2050, we will be living on another planet. How do we know what planet we're living on now? 
<laughs> I mean, I haven't flown up to verify. Personally, <laughs> we could be anywhere. <laughs> Don says flat earthers are going first. Oh, shit. <laughs> Look out. Oh, that's what she says? That's what Sylvia Brown says? Or she, what she used to say. Rest her soul. I think I think she passed back in like the 2010s. Somewhere around in there. Her show was on for 17 years. Or the Montel show, yeah. I know. And she always just had that crazy look in her eye or whatever. But she like she would always get people all up in their feels when she was doing her reads or whatever. You only watch it because of her. Red Sky. I'll believe it when I see it. <laughs> Don says, let me out of this simulation. Simulacra and simulation. Well, you know, it's crazy. Yo, I mean, w whether we're living in a simulation or not is kind of irrelevant unless... Unless, you know, we're going to have like a conversation about getting out of the simulation <laughs> because or, or how to hack it, you know, hacking the simulation. What's going on, Caroline? If we're going to talk about how to hack the simulation. <laughs> holodeck. Well, consciousness is weird, right? Our consciousness, you know, what what is consciousness really? I mean that we're still we're still investigating and you know they, they're talking about how like uh you know our our brains uh, like i don't i don't know exactly the, with the terminology okay but apparently there's something quantum <laughs> quantum happening there <laughs> whatever that means uh my, my limited knowledge on the subject our brains being cognitive quantum engines of some sort i don't know i don't know Some of her tours got canceled. Oh, the Madonna thing. Well, now it's hit my radar now, Red Sky. So I'm going to be listening for that shit. Oh, you know what? I think I did hear about that. Because of some kid that she supposedly adopted or something. I don't know. I don't, I don't want to speculate on it, but I, I remember hearing about it. Referring to Red Sky's, uh, he was talking about something about Madonna, and I think it was like one of the kids she adopted. So I'm probably getting this wrong, you know, but Google it, I guess. Google it! <laughs> if, we, if we're talking hacking the simulation, step one, call Swigs. <laughs> are you kidding me? Swigs will probably just keep us plugged in. He, he, wants, he wants everything. He's, he's tech support. Okay, if we want to get out of the simulation, then we got to call Roddy Roddy Piper. <laughs> or like, you know, Keanu Reeves or, you know, Lawrence Fishburne. Um, yeah. <laughs> um, aliens are in the ocean. What? Hold on. Red Sky. Aliens are in the ocean. We got the grounds and skies. All hoaxes. Wait, 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 wait. So the, the, the ground, the ground is a hoax? The sky and the ground are both hoaxes. Well, the thing is like what pe what we don't know about can totally hurt us. <laughs> uh, and walking the earth with us. Mm. Greetings, earthlings. <laughs> you seen how I opened that with the with my new stream my new stream description Hashtag see more butts Yeah I'm gonna go down here. Hey, where did you go, dude? He was here a second ago and then he flew away I'm so glad that we built this out here because now I can run around outside in the dark and not get blown up by stupid creepers Ha <laughs> ha 
<laughs> that, I was trying to be subtle. <laughs> I didn't even actually realize that I dipped into Marvin the Martian voice. If I tried to do it intentionally, I probably wouldn't be able to. Didn't the president admit this? Admit what? Presidents don't really admit anything. That's kind of their job. Like, the, the president is like the first line of defense for PR. Like, he's, he's like the designated fall guy, right? So he, he doesn't really admit to anything. If he admits to something, it's like, you know, we messed up. <laughs> we messed up here. You know, there was a intelligence failure or something. You know, it's never like, I fucked up, you know. <laughs> it doesn't matter who, who the president is either. It's like, their job is just to be there when shit goes down so that they can take all the blame. Or their, their party can take all the blame. And everyone else can just be like, just point and be like, it, it was them! <laughs> they did it! It was those! Whatever. We're all responsible. Don't get me started. <laughs> Red Sky, we messed up as a nation. Yeah, exactly. That's what they say. It's like, we have collectively messed up. Like, wait, 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 wait. Hold up. <laughs> Hold on. Wait a minute. I didn't do shit. <laughs> I was over here playing Minecraft. Okay. You guys fucked up. Some, one of, one of you over there in that big fucking house over there on the East Coast. All right. One of you motherfuckers. <laughs> one of you guys fucked that up. I was playing Minecraft. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> Yeah. Only, ah, uh, you know, whatever. Caroline, I hear you. But uh, you know, e evil is is a very relative thing, isn't it? And and like, if if I've learned anything in all of my years, it's that, and and th I'll take you know, I don't know. Like I, I mean, shit, I'm probably evil in certain ways like to some people like i don't know you know what i mean like not hooking up for example i mean the sheer caucasity <laughs> um you know me not hooking up but i mean no but no seriously like we're all kind of evil i mean you know we're all we're all a little bit evil and it's amplified when you're when you're in a position of power so yeah i don't know i hear this i hear this this argument like on on both sides where like people will well both sides all sides any side the top side the upside downside whatever side but people like have a, they always have a tendency to like see something outside of themselves over there as evil right and rarely i'm just saying like i don't know I feel like if if we try to like just be cooler ourselves two people <laughs> red sky i'm evil fighting crime stopper <laughs> yeah um hold on don what don don what'd you say did you see that video i shared of uh the boss where putin kim what putin kim and biden we're meeting the boss and his mask falls off at the end and it's Elon. <laughs> what the fuck? Don, you're always tagging me in the weirdest shit. Okay, he says, he says, did you see that video I shared of the boss where Putin, Kim and Biden were meeting the boss and his mask falls off at the end and it's Elon. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, I mean, And which Elon are we talking about? Elon, Elon the alien, Elon the billionaire, Elon the f the philanthropist. His work is his philanthropy. That's what he says. Um, Alzavano, like it, liking the stream from work, and then dipping. <laughs> 
right, I'm going to fly around and see what you guys have been working on, if anything. Um, where is my... I need more fireworks, though. Yikes. Mustafa, what up? <laughs> hey, yo. hey there, uh, fellow young person. <laughs> yeah. How are you? Hi there, kitties. Hi there, meow meows. Oh, I miss I miss kitties. But I like totals. Does anybody know where Prophet's fireworks are so I can steal some? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. John, great question. Um John says, uh, what's your thoughts on shit being shot down for the seventh time in the past week? <laughs> Which is uh, a little bit of an exaggeration, but, you know, yeah, on a certain level, you kind of just got to go like, what the hell is actually happening here? Because, I mean, hold on, let's go over here to the, to this scene here. Um. So, uh, I also, I just want to throw this out there. Guys, uh, if you have a chance at any point during the stream today, jump in here, jump in this little group, and uh, jump on the live panel. And I just want to test it out. I want to see uh, how we're able to, like, bring people up and set people on the panel, etc., etc. I'm trying to test this out today. So, uh, if you're watching and you want to just jump in and say hi real quick in the Discord, that would be an easy way for me to test this out. Um, so that we can have... More organized, structured conversations about whatever it is, whatever the topic is. So, uh, if you're in there and I don't see you, just uh, either message the chat or uh, I think the live Discord chat, live chat, should also get my attention. Um, and it also actually may just pop up if you raise your hand to speak or however that works. Um, but yeah, the as far as the, the weather balloon shit, I was like... Um, I, I think I'm just as confused as everybody else because I don't think anybody has really talked about this in a way where it's like definitive and this is what this is and we know everything and uh, you know, here's the evidence, etc, cetera, etc. Cetera. It's kind of just like there was some unidentified, you know, weather balloon type things in different various shapes. There was at least like, I don't know, two or three of them. I don't know exactly how many there was. And... The word like there's all this speculation as to the origin of it, but not a lot of whole a whole lot of official information coming out and it's just odd. Or the way that the way that it's being handled is very odd. Like it shouldn't it should just be kind of open factual information open and shut maybe and maybe it is to some people but to me i was like every time i heard somebody talking about it it was like wait what <laughs> you it's it was what <laughs> um uh red sky says distraction they're gonna make us uh they're gonna make it look like they are our saviors so we feel safe from their help just my opinion uh, okay. Yeah. I mean... Yeah, it's it's kind of weird. It's just a weird phenomenon to happen all of a sudden. And, you know, because... Like, number one, I'm under the impression that if, if we have... Like... Like, why is it even a big deal, first of all? If, if it's like... Some other nation's... You know, weather balloon or some shit... Or if it, if it is if it is a quote unquote spy balloon, it just seems it just seems kind of weird. Like in the age of you know us like satellites, twenty four seven surveillance, uh, you know TikTok, Facebook, Twitter, NSA, uh, spying and you know on everything that we do. Is there really like I, I mean if it's just for intelligence gathering, I don't know. It's just weird. Oh, thank you. Thank you for the fireworks. Heck yeah. 
Appreciate that. Um, War of the Worlds and we're doomed. <laughs> um, yeah, probably not. Okay. All right, so... Sometime you need help learning to fly, Caroline. Um, yeah, it's... It's not super tough, but you need uh, open space, like a platform over the water or close to the water. Actually, right over here would probably be a really good spot to learn. Um, or we could uh, just model our behavior after the spy balloons. <laughs> and uh, just reach a really high altitude right and then just surveil <laughs> yeah i just i have i have like i'm ske i'm sketched by the whole thing it's sketchy bro it's sketchy you know like we, we, we there should be we should have definitive information and the fact that we don't or the fact that it's kind of like obscure information is troubling downplay it because the truth was was released there there would be mass hysteria i mean yeah maybe maybe the truth i think i think maybe the truth is just the better path to go with at this point because so much crazy shit happens like just tell people the truth man everybody always expect like oh no people are gonna freak out like so what then, then let's all freak out let's all freak out together <laughs> I, I just feel like when you're in a position of power or you're in a position where you're privy to like classified information um I think that there's kind of like this pretentious like self-importance thing that happens where your ego gets tied to it and you're like oh i'm important because i know things <laughs> or like or like i you know I, we can't just let people know what i know because you know people wouldn't be able to handle it it just seems like a very like shallow intellectual vantage point to just be like you know, nobody can know about this because it's it will it'll put us all in danger. And, you know, it's this like very like paternal condescending disposition where you think that because you know, I don't know, and maybe there's maybe there's like circumstances where you would want to be careful with information, but I don't know. I, I feel like it's it's kind of uh, it's an old archaic way of thinking in my opinion. <laughs> Got to give the ET brothers a little more credit than that. <laughs> uh, hanging out in a balloon while letting the jets shoot them out of orbit. Yeah, I mean, th these, I really don't think any of this is ET stuff. Because, it, you know, it's just, it, it probably just isn't, you know, I don't see, I don't, I mean, I think it would be obvious if it was something like that. Or, you know, I think it's more likely that it's either, it's either like uh what's it called? It's either like a, like a psyop type of situation where, oh, wow. Caroline, you have uh, expanded your territory here immensely. Look at this. Look at all this stuff. Did you build all this? Holy smokes. It's like a whole village over here. I'm digging the feng shui, the vibe of it all. Uh, John, three other incidents where they shot down UFO. Okay, there, there was two balloons, and there were three other incidents where they shot down UFOs. Is that is that what is that is that true? So five total. <laughs> oh Jesus. <laughs> Um, 
Yeah, I mean. Yeah. You built most of it. Donna built the majority of the sandstone structure. The one that I just blew into and couldn't. <laughs> where, where do I get in here? Oh, God. Villager breeding and trading hall. Established 2-12-2023. Donna designed the roof. Very nice. Yeah, I like I like the wooden house, though. Or the... Red sky. I mean, but what does that even mean? Like, if we don't know about it, and it's some kind of, like, occult thing, then it's... it's them. <laughs> it's them. Trading hall A. Oh, okay, so you, get, you set up, like... I see. She's setting it up to where you're going to have, like, a villager in each little booth. Yeah, I got you. I got you. The breeding grounds are open. <laughs> That's cool. Nice, nice, nice. Very cool. Central part is for breeding. Oh god, oh god. It's over here? Ah! What in the... Oh, I see the button's up here. Oh, what the... I need to turn on my flashlight. I can't see a thing! <laughs> Red sky. <laughs> oh, I see. Well... I suppose I suppose we can let them breed in peace. <laughs> and plus I can't see and it's one hallway and I'm losing my mind already. But this is awesome. I'm glad uh, Prophet helped you out with that. That's mad coral, bro. Terminology because they weren't uh, sure whether it was themselves doesn't really mean aliens, uh, but I like the alien theory better. I mean, I like uh, the idea of it being aliens. You know, just because that would be new and different and awesome and uh, newsworthy, right? But it's it's also like, you know, I... But because I actually want it to be that, I'm super skeptical anytime information comes out because I want it to just be obvious. Like, there's no denying, you know, what it is. There's no denying it. You know, there's no way around it. Like, the, the aliens are outside your house or something, you know? You're like, hey, man. <laughs> you know, like the voice of Korg. <laughs> Korg, like, like, the Korg, you know, character, you know, showing up outside your house. Like, hey, man, <laughs> we're going to uh, the next solar system over. You want to come? <laughs> um, okay. All right. Show me. Lead the way. We're checking out uh, stuff that Caroline's been working on, you guys. Oh, God! I'm... Frick. Can our sanity and our hearts handle the sight of an alien? I mean, yeah. Who cares? <laughs> See, that's what I mean. It's like, there's always this assumption that, like, people will not be able to handle it. Or, like, and you know, because I, I, I wonder about this, too. Like, yeah, if... Because we do have cognitive dissonance. We have different you know like uh, what's it called um you know functions in our brain that have kind of like evolved with us in order to keep us from completely losing our minds and being able to function right but uh you know so there could be like some function of our brain that is like would see an alien and be like just kind of like shut down <laughs> like or i don't know you know maybe but I mean, it could also it could also just be that we're un, we're unable we're like we're incapable of um, conceptualizing like the nature of their existence or even like of our existence really like fuck 
most of us can't even comprehend our own existence let alone the existence of something that is you know like 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 the when you try to ask somebody what what is well and now we're getting deep into it but if you try to ask somebody what god is you're going to get a different answer you know depending on who you ask and like it's always kind of like this idealized version of what a higher power might be and i don't know but like how do we even conceptualize like a higher dimensional consciousness that you know let's say it can travel through space and time or something or like you know the fourth dimension is its plaything, you know and it just like lives in higher dimensionality and and like have you guys seen like the there's like a there's youtube videos and tiktok videos about like the difference between like when you go from 2d to 3d or like 1d to 2d right and like how a 1d organism might perceive 2d and then like how a 2d organism might perceive 3d and then of course we're 3d organisms right and potentially there's some aspect of us that is timeless which we you know we don't know for sure yet right where are we going ba -ba -dum -ba. Ba -ba -da. oh did you guys see the new indiana jones trailer ba -ba -dum -ba. Ba -ba -da -ba 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 -da -ba crystal skulls um uh, but yeah like i'd like to think that we're smart enough to comprehend it but maybe it would just be weird if we saw it maybe we wouldn't even maybe we wouldn't even get it yeah <laughs> maybe so red sky I sure have sampled quite a lot of that stuff, and if anybody should be able to comprehend it, it's me. <laughs> I've had a good test run with it, yep, and uh, I believe I have perceived such things. <laughs> Intermittently, of course, but uh, nevertheless. Oh yeah, the Michael Keaton, the Michael Keaton thing. Uh, there, they, there was a huge spoiler in uh, the Flash uh, movie trailer, you guys, if you didn't see it. And... Uh, yeah, apparently there's going to be uh, uh, timelines, you know, d overlapping with the Batmans. And so we get to, uh, audiences get to enjoy the Michael Keaton Batman once again. <laughs> Fat dab at DMT. <laughs> I got... Oh, Carl. Hmm. Huh. <laughs> I heard a kitty cat. You built this, but it only sometimes works. You're still figuring it out. Right on. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. I haven't even experimented with doing like villager trading, trading or whatever at all. This is all next level. Oh my god. Ah! glass so it's two-tiered an auto crop farm oh okay pretty cool yep help okay very cool auto crop trading posts do not disturb until further notice gotcha if they're if they're here to invade we're meeting at dennis's house to party our final days agreed <laughs> oh shit poor dennis he has to deal with us no matter what kind of uh end of the world scenario plays out <laughs> yeah these damn trick doors dude every time uh, you know it's like you hit the button and then you got to run through that's why i, I I prefer the the floor uh, panel ones, but or just like just leave a door so that well, yeah. But you, I don't know. You got to protect your your domain, right? The switches protect it from being invaded by by things, so that's why people do it. But yeah, like me with the pyramid, where I just leave everything open. Yeah, yeah. yeah go ahead, lead the way. 
an open floor plan. We'll take care of him for hosting us. <laughs> Where'd you go? I lost you. Oh, you went up here. Cool, cool, cool. Hey, Palmer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Palmer, the question is, can we comprehend, like, like if we were to see an alien, would we even see it, right? Because, like, maybe we can't comprehend its, its existence in the first place. Especially if it's not a regular, like, 3D being. Like us. If it's some higher dimensional entity that can, like, choose whether or not we see it, you know, or maybe it exists beyond time and space. So the way that it interacts with time and space would be, it would be different than how we interact with it. Taco, what up? Hell busy doing flooring and painting this week. Uh, Coral. This is very nice. Very nice. This is your dye making station. Well, it's very lovely. I bet it looks awesome at nighttime. With my graphics. Yeah. For sure. Maybe they're sitting next to us and eating supper. Yeah, exactly. Red sky. I think that's part of it too. Like that's kind of why, like, like that's kind of why. Uh, Abe says RDR. You want to play some RDR, bro? Uh, I think that's kind of why, like, I always kind of cringe a little bit when people are like aliens. When nine times out of ten, it's probably just either our government or somebody else's government or or some kind of like uh, what's it called? Like a black budget you know organization or like a you know what i mean or like a uh off the off the record kind of uh you know corporation that just does weird shit <laughs> but, you know because they can and they're not uh beholden to any particular government they live in or you know like they're stationed in international waters or like in outer space or something you know the weird experiments that they're probably doing in space i don't know dude my point is like because there's like the weird things that humans are doing and then there's you know actual aliens or whatever which i don't know like maybe if we're talking about just beings from other planets fine you know because maybe that's a thing too maybe there's maybe there's an overlap or a distinction that should be made between aliens and interdimensional beings right <laughs> beings from other planets differentiated uh from like interdimensional you know species or whatever like because think about it if they're interdimensional or like you know they can exist kind of anywhere or anytime maybe maybe they are us dude maybe maybe like we're like just maybe we're like the avatars that they hop in and out of you know like a video game <laughs> Like they just log in and they're like, oh man. So I'm I'm on Earth again. Fuck. <laughs> I'm on Earth again. Shit, this is whack. Well, I'm gonna log out, dude. Fuck this. <laughs> it's like it's like me when I log into GTA, you know, I'm just like, oh fuck. Same shit. <laughs> yeah. Dennis was in here for a minute. Dennis, how did we offend you? Trover style. Yeah, maybe Trover style. Caroline, I just want to say great work. Keep up the great work. This is awesome. There's a ladder inside inside here. Oh. Cool, cool, cool. There's, there's so much you added. Oh. 
This is your uh, your portal. Cool. The upper room. <laughs> that was horrible. The upper room. Ray's boom boom room. Brought to you by Microsoft. <laughs> Settle down, Don. Shuttle do. Shuttle do. Uh, all right. Okay. All right, Caroline. Sweet. Whoa. What is this? What is this right here? What is this right here? What is this right here? What is this? What is this building? Did I see this already? Ow. The only left building is Villager Hall modeled after. Well, this is cool. It's a prison. <laughs> I know a prison when I see one. And it's never the ones I build. People lie. That's awesome, Caroline. Great work. Hey, what is it? We are aliens. We just dumbed down. We're just, we're just the dumbed down unplugged version. <laughs> what do you mean by that, Abe? We're the dumbed down unplugged version of aliens. Like, do you guys think, do you guys think we're avatars? And that's, I don't know. Because then you, then you get into like, if, if we're avatars, right? Then you know what that might mean? I, I'm going to, I'm going to say this reluctantly with, with a little bit of cringe and side eye to my own comment here. But, uh, if, if being, you know, if the avatar situation is real, where like, you know, interdimensional higher, you know, dimensional beings can like inhabit our bodies temporarily, then that might mean that, uh, possession is like a real thing or whatever which is i mean i have a problem with that inherently just because number one it's kind of freaky okay number two uh you know it it uh <laughs> i don't know man it's like you know when you look at like a shit ton of religious text and stuff like that you kind of i mean i guess on a certain level we kind of have to analyze these beliefs for their validity you know, from a scientific perspective. And I think that's, you know, I think most of the time, because, uh, you know, because of the way that, that those like distinctions have been used in the past, like when you look at, uh, like just possession or like, you know, like the witch hate the, the Salem witch trials or some shit, or, you know, like, uh, where historically there has been this like obscure or this, like a, you know, just abuse that occurs where where people are wronged and uh it was for the on the basis of uh you know the claim that they were quote unquote evil or like you know possessed or uh otherwise compromised by evil you know which brings us back kind of we, we went full circle there now we're back to talking about evil people <laughs> oh wow yikes profit house welcome apparently Callum uh, won a medal so congrats Callum here we go again right back into GTA here we go again evil the evil people Aww. you know who they are or oh, you're one of them <laughs> no, <that's kidding. laughs> look at you armor you think you're so smart don't you Aww. look at you 
Think you know everything. You don't know anything, Ama. <laughs> hmm? It's the beginning of knowledge. Fireworks might be... Oh my god. Well, that was weird. My audio went away for a second. I'm disappointed that I can't I can't run my clip machine. Actually, hold on. Let's see. Let's see if I can just record. Well, but see, that's the backtracking thing that makes it all worth it there. So right now, wait a minute. Okay, controls. Uh, okay, I have the replay buffer going. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to turn it down to uh, 30 frames per second. That's my lesson. That's my takeaway for today. Ewalt. Here, look. Uh, you guys want to see retro mode? Boom. Retro mode. Bum bada bum 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 bada bum 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 bum. Bam! It's the nineteen nineties. And beautiful. Oof. Stay down here so I don't get swooped. What do you guys think? Should we play something else? You guys, you guys want to play something else? Should I RDR this bitch? Let's freaking RDR this bitch, god dang. <laughs> Let's go over here. Huh. Save and quit. Hold on, let me... Hold on, I gotta change. <clears throat> What's going on there, goddamn? Heard y'all like uh, cowboy shit. <laughs> yeah, Don. Yeah, man. It's a uh, pixel latte, man. So serve yourself a cup. Let's fucking go. <laughs> okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, where the fuck is RDR? Yeah, boom, bada bang, bada boom, bada bang. <laughs> you got that? Okay, let's go. Let's go. Got to the dang. So uh, I'm gonna be playing on PC, Abe. Abe, since you're the only one that can play, and Dr. Boom. Dr. Boom! <laughs> oh, fuck. What'd I do? I think it's still loading in. You're already on, Dr. Boom? Okay. Well, shit, then. Let's fucking go. <laughs> no, nah, but I want it to be, uh, I want to be able to jump from game to game. And just have like, uh, you know, have a fun session where we talk about bullshit that's going on, right? In the news, whatever, what have you. Uh, at any given point, like I said, if anybody wants to jump in and talk shit to me or uh, have a conversation, we have a little space opened up right here just to do that. And uh, that way, you know, if we get going on a topic and we, and we want to discuss something or somebody wants to uh, jump in, then we got the capability to do that. Okay. Yeah. So, versatility, God dang. <laughs> Versatility. It's the word, man. I promise. <laughs> oh shit. Tan lines. <laughs> okay, look. Uh online. Free roam. Let me restart the posse. So yeah, I, like, cause I, I just want to be able to play, you know, any game I want to, you know, have a session where we just kind of hang out and do whatever the fuck I want. And then I can call a day, make my clips, post my clips up, do the damn thing that way. From my glasses. Oh, on the old, uh, did I really have, maybe I did. <laughs> uh, 
Dark Side of the Moon, welcome. Okay, Abe's online. I'm loading in, goddamn. Y'all ready to do this? Should I zoom in more? You guys like that? Okay. <laughs> Close and personal. Let me back up. Let me back up. My, am I crowding your space? <laughs> okay. Let's fucking go, man. All right, here we go. Here we go. Shit, I got to remember what the buttons are and everything. First things first. God dang posse. Reform posse. You reformed. Hey, look. Oh, what? <laughs> Red Scott. You seen that, right? Dark side of the moon has entered the chat. <laughs> Welcome back. What do y'all think is on the dark side of the moon? You think it's anything cool? Or do you think it's something stupid? <laughs> I bet it's something dumb. Like just more moon. <laughs> it's just more moon. I don't know. Yeah, no, that, yeah, well, I'm attracting my tribe out here, I guess. Okay, now. Shit. Hell, get, get out of here, mouse. Red Sky said it's flat. That's why we can't see. <laughs> uh, you better quit. All right. Like, quit while you're ahead, man. Flat moon. What's up, Abe? What's up, my guy? Hey, hey, y'all, y'all gonna get in the Discord, man, so I can test this out. Hey, see, I went to a different screen, man. Can't nobody see what you're doing. All right. <laughs> uh, okay, Doctor Boom's in here. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, Doctor Boom. Okay, so uh, let's see. Uh, Doctor Boom, do me a favor and raise your hand like you want to speak or something. Show requests. Okay, right now there's no request. This is just so I, cause so I can learn how to do this shit. Okay, there we go. Invite to speak. Request to speak. Invite to speak. Hey, can you hear me? Yeah, I can still hear you. I could, I could hear you before. Oh, okay, cool. So, all right, yeah, yeah, duh. But you couldn't hear me. Right, that makes sense. Okay. So, so yeah, this is kind of a cool, uh, different uh, format that allows me to have a little bit more control over the conversation. Main reason I wanted to do this is because... I think it gives me better uh, moderating opportunities and that way like if people want to just dip out they still want to listen but they want to you know dip out they can do that you know I don't know it's just a little bit more control hey check you out hold on I got fancy yeah I was gonna say you got you got yourself a brand new dress and everything look like you got hitched Did somebody wife you up <laughs> <No>. <laughs> oh shit God dang, that's a prettier Jess than Riri had on last night. You see that Riri performance? <laughs> I didn't watch it. Oh, you didn't watch it? Okay. Well, it was just a bunch of capitalist propaganda anyway. You ain't missed much. <laughs> uh, you know I saw that. that they had a thing about, uh, what's his name, Tillman. Who? Uh, the soldier that died, Tillman. He was a NFL player. Oh, okay. Yeah, I didn't hear about that part. Uh, I... Yeah. So what was that about? He, he there was a soldier that he he died from uh, friendly fire. He oh, was shit. against the war. Oh wow! And then the government t uh, covered it up. Oh dang! Really? Yeah. So was it? And this was something that they talked about, like as a part of, like it was just something that came out separate. What do you mean separate? Like how did you hear about it, or like what it? What was the? It's been out for a while. Okay. I, I just knew about it. I got you. I got you. Hey, you gonna jump uh, in here or now? They told his family like some elaborate lie oh, about. Here. They told his family. Died. Yeah. What did they tell him? 
that he was a hero and stuff. Come to find out, um, it was his own people from 10 yards away. Oh, wow. Three uh, bullets in his head. Damn, dude. That's dirty. Okay, Abe, I see you. I'm going to bring you up to speak. Can I only do two people at, or one person at a time in here? I can. No, I'm just, know. I'm just wondering. Hold on. Uh. Speakers two. Uh. Okay, hold on. Stage. No, I think you can have more than two up there. Abe, did you, did you uh? Request to speak. Invite sent. Abe, hey, you got to click something still, or is it not letting you jump up? Maybe you can on. Oh, there it goes. Oh, there you go. Okay, gotta cool. Click accept. Yeah, I was like, I was like, fuck, Yo. we can't have more than two people. I was like, what the shit? <laughs> I was saying, you just want me to raise my hand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, that's how it works. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> he, was, he was raising his hand. You just couldn't see him. <laughs> okay. All yeah, right. that Pat Pat Tillman story is pretty crazy. Yeah, Pat Tillman. That's who it was. Bad Tillman. It's freaking wild, dude. So, uh -huh. so y'all want to fill me in on this? So basically, he he was killed in action and by his own people is what you're saying by the by our troops. Yeah, and then they yeah. burned all of his stuff right after. So they, they tried burned all of his. So they his, tr they tried to, to cover, cover it up. up. Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. So how did the truth get out then? Did somebody uh, snitch on? I think his family. I don't know. That part I don't know. And that's 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 crazy. Sounds like his family didn't buy the story or something. Yeah, so they had an investigation. Well, he's a big NFL star too. Oh, I that's think they're that's trying to figure it out. I see. That's why. Then okay. Hey man, sometimes it's only the the high profile folks that allow us to really understand mm -hmm. what's really going on. You know, you get somebody who's well known. You know, that can like motivate people to do the right thing. I don't know. He was in correspondence with Noam Chomsky. Oh shit. Noam Chomsky, were, he's a badass. Yeah. About his anti-war feeling. Yeah. So what 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 conflict was this during? He was, I think, he was in Afghanistan. Afghanistan, uh -huh. okay. Oh, how do you? Around uh, Fallujah. Oh wow. Like when it was bad. Yeah. During like one of the worst times. Well, ain't nothing good came out of that. Well, for some people. Yeah, I mean, I suppose. <laughs> the, <laughs> the war profiteers, I guess they did okay. Yeah. God dang. Um, well, shit. Anyways. Let, yeah, <laughs> anywho, let's lighten up the room a little bit. I don't know. God dang. Uh, no, it's fine. Uh, Sorry. Sorry. You're good. You're good, man. Like I said, I want to be able to talk about whatever the hell we feel like nothing's taboo except for like shit that i say i don't want to talk about <laughs> you see my fancy guns no i didn't i seen your fancy outfit but well 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 oh man gold plated right. oops not that you got your you got your guns gold dipped don't get don't have a smelting accident now <laughs> <laughs> Got dang gold member over here. The uh, it's a bonus on gold right now. Probably the best there's ever possibly could be. Oh really? For everything or just like specific missions? Specific missions, three times gold. So what? What? Which missions will give us the three times gold? The telegram, the hardcore telegram missions. Okay. They're kind of hard, but um, I was gonna say I'm, I'm scared to do them. I think you, I think it does a normal at first, and then after that, it's hard. It's hard it mode. But I, but I know the the path. You know the way. I know the way. It's easy if you do it silent. But deadly. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> I mean, there's you don't have to shoot any. Like nobody shoots at you or anything. Hey, but I know you watched the game yesterday. Did you? Who? Who? Who are you rooting for? The Eagles. Were you? Oh shit, man! So yeah. you you almost broke your TV. You see that video of the dude, but it no, broke the I'm TV. I'm not an Eagles fan. <laughs> yeah, I seen that. 
that fool. Y'all seen that? Hold on. Yeah, that shit was crazy. Y'all see the video? He threw, his drink at, he threw his drink at it, and then he <laughs> fucking started punching it. I saw, I saw the video. I was like, oh, my God. He he lost it, man. Joe Poe with the 200. Thank you, Joe Poe. That's like the second year in a row there's been a video like that where somebody destroys their TV. I, I was wondering, like, they didn't set this up, did they? But he looked big mad. He looked like he yeah, was... Yeah, he looked really mad. Like, he started pushing like people he, and shit. <laughs> he probably lost some money on that game. Oh, yeah. He, he lost some money, and he had to pay for somebody's TV. <laughs> Uh -huh. Unless that was his TV, but even Hopefully still, that was his damn TV. <laughs> you know who to not invite next time. Yeah, no shit, man. Now, if it wasn't his TV, he probably would have got knocked TV. knocked out. I mean, yeah, you can't just go breaking somebody else's TV and not get knocked out. There's man. all kinds of wildlife. Chat, y'all, anybody, any y'all see that? Better, better ask somebody. God dang, that oh, shit was crazy. One stars, Jesus. Yeah. <laughs> Every single freaking got, one of them. He got horns though. Oh, this, that one. this is a good I spot. Didn't even look over there. But they all one star. Yeah, it was yeah. one star. I mean, it'll be worth. Oh, this one's two star. I killed him with the bow. Hey, there you go. Let's see. I can do high quality. That's about it, though. What y'all got? I think I have some big game. I was killing alligators. I don't see you out here shooting gators. <laughs> oh, careful there, uh, Miss Daisy. The, I can do the. <laughs> yeah, I know. My <laughs> dress is going to go up. I can do oh, the can't. venison mushroom. Oh, shit. Okay. You big, big flexing then. Did you already do yours? I, no, I, I didn't have it actually. All right. I thought I killed some big game. All I can do is high qual. I think I donated it maybe. Hey. There you go. Crypt special. Oops. Take venison and mushroom stew. Crypt's gonna act like he made it too. Mm. Gotta use the mushroom somehow. I don't, how else do you use mushrooms? I don't know if there's anything else you can use it for besides cooking. I keep picking them up. I don't think I had this soup before. It'll treat you right. <laughs> uh huh. You got dang. I donated that carcass. Hell yeah. What uh, is this over here? That's what I was just looking at. Four horses. We got one here. God dang it. Why does this, this mouse keep on jumping back in here? Fuck off my screen. Who's this guy? Two star. Kill him with the bow. There's a three star right here. <laughs> oh. I have a legendary buck antler that's worth 5.25. <laughs> Risk guy says. He's with as, as far as the mushrooms go. He said, "Use it or lose it." <laughs> oh. <laughs> I don't know if that's true, man. It better not be. <laughs> Three star pronghorn. Oh, white tail buck. Those are worth a lot. I kill them. So we could try to do one of them telegrams, I guess. If we do a little bit of hunting. One star. Don't need materials. Oh, quit your crying, Crips. Let's take what we got here. So the supplies are running down fast. We got to do a resupply. He's always bitching. That's all he does. It's like that's what we pay him for, but it ain't. Oh uh, yeah, this is one of the best spots, Red Sky. This, I, in fact, I think this is the best hunting spot in the game right here. <clears throat> best spot to have camp for hunting. 
Yeah. If you get it. Easy there. Y'all's audio quality sounds better than normal for some reason. I don't know why. What y'all are doing different. Or maybe it's just. Maybe it's what I set up on my end. I don't know. Well, I can't. I can't donate this. It won't let you donate it? No, it won't let me press Y. Oh, weird. It's like locked out. I'm gonna stow it. I'm gonna try it. Oh, yeah, it's halted. Did you, like, shoot somebody halted. or. No, it's halted. Oh, we, oh yeah. Well, you should be able to still be able to give him something. Mm -mm. He should be able to. I just I'm gave sure. him something. Nope. Even, even he was halted before that. Oh, really? It said low for me. It didn't say it was halted. Yeah, let me. I, I just gave him something. I know that. But yeah. now it's all grayed out. Before, maybe it's just being weird. Maybe start a mission. Well, here, let me try to donate it. Yeah, pick it up. Try it. Oh, yeah, it let you go in there. That's weird. What the hell? Yeah. Yeah, it's, me too. You need to damage someone or what? It said I've damaged somebody or their horse. I didn't even do nothing to anybody. Well, you did rope There's me. No Oh, what? But I already did. <laughs> that was like a while already, ago, though. <laughs> yeah, I traded him something after that. Yeah, that was like forever ago. I don't know. I just noticed it said that right now. Well, let's do this resupply. Recently damaged somebody. Start resupply mission. No Here one we go. didn't. Okay, I didn't know such thing. How I know this, but <laughs> some of our fellow traders are having some transportation difficulties. Stranded at the mercy of brigands and outlaws. Are y'all watching so that Last of Us show nice at all? Or we can play smart. And you aren't very Y'all ain't PlayStation. Y'all ain't PlayStation people, so I understand. I get it. <laughs> it's a good show though. Still. Last, of Us, Last of Us comes out on PC in March. Dude, I can't wait. I, I oh, shit. because at that point, I, like that I know that they're gonna put part two out at some point after that. And then so then I can actually uh, get rid of my PlayStation and not cry about it. <laughs> <laughs> There's a few other games that haven't come out yet for PC, but I but it's it's not enough to where I can justify keeping the PlayStation anymore, so But I know there's gonna be some exclusive shit like is it uh, Isn't the Harry Potter game exclusive or no? I think no, oh, okay. No Some of the missions are oh, that's dumb Yeah Is that the supplies oh, shit, already? I'm getting, yeah, I'm getting messed up Like disconnect this mouse keeps on. Funk. He's chasing me. I'm dead now. Damn, they're all chasing me. Yeah, you think they're, they're mad at you? Here, come over there. Holy oh, shit! Hey, you lit him up. <laughs> yeah, I just ride the horse up here to supervise. <laughs> oh, I don't miss. <laughs> nice work, everybody. <laughs> Y'all should get a raise. <laughs> Y'all ain't gonna loot none of this? Nah. Nah. <laughs> I killed the collector and got some rare stuff. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> Weird. Wait, where's my horse? Oh, shit. He didn't make it yet. I'm a looties. I'm a looties, god dang. Nope, don't pick up the enemy. <laughs> I'm trying to pick up the bag. I picked this fool up. Oh, this is so far of a drive. Yeah, no, careful uh, right on your adventure. <laughs> is it not going to let... Oh, here we go. It's the closest supply mission I've ever seen. I need you. Hey, I need you to go on a supply run across the street. <laughs> it's Literally. like it's like when Mama sends you for milk or something. I didn't even have to ride the horse, man. I just ran over here. <laughs> <It's> right there. <laughs> 
Yeah, dang. All too easy. You can hear the birdies chirping. Well done. <laughs> Crips is like, cool, man. I was too lazy to go down there. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, well, well. Let's try to do one of those telegrams. And get some gold. Do it. All right. So the I know two of them really well. That's it. Okay. Hold on. So uh, which one is it? Con Skelding's contracts. Skelding's contracts, and it's the second one, the middle one. Go to Skelding's. Strong medicine strong. or? Yeah, strong medicine. Okay, this is going to be standard. I can't. We'll have to do. That's uh, fine. Okay. No, that's fine. Right, it's still go. the same gold payout. Okay, cool. I'm assuming it's going to load. But we'll see. Third All right. Loaded. Basically, I'm just going to do it all. Oh, shit. Well, okay. <laughs> uh, I mean, we can provide support. No, there's a couple places where um, we get rolled two of up us on. need to... No, two, no we, don't, we won't even get rolled up on, but two of us need to shoot them at the same time. Oh, wait a minute. Is this this is this is the one? No, that's the other one. I think the first one is the one where you got two different people you got to go get, right? Strong medicine. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> that's what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. Don, you about to watch uh, Bruce Leroy? Red Sky, you about to rock, watch Bruce Leroy? What's it called? The Drag Enter the or no? What's that movie called? Enter the Dragon. No, the the uh, the one um, with Show Nuff. Show Nuff. Last Dragon. Last Dragon, right? Yeah, the last dragon. Yeah, that's a classic, man. I gotta rewatch that. I haven't seen that in so long. <laughs> that's such a good movie, dude. It's so stupid, but it's like, you are the last dragon. <laughs> you have all the power. <laughs> and he does, he's like, he's all sweating. You see it like he's in like a one of them. Uh, what was what, <laughs> what was the character from? Uh, uh, God dang, come to America, and he had that that uh, soul glow. <laughs> it looked like he all he all up in oh, the snow, yeah. the soul glow. <laughs> Fucking body oils on, and then they make him glow on top of that. You got the glow, Bruce Leroy. <laughs> oh man, that's a classic. Your mama name into the chat. Okay, so this one. Oh yeah, yeah. This is the one where we pick fools off. Mm -hmm. Kind of a low-key mission. Oh, stealth what mission. The hell? <laughs> what the hell was that? Yeah, what? Why are you, why are you I, girl tripping? I thought you was getting know. kidnapped there for a second. Oh, and then, we gonna have to save Miss Daisy. You got her foot caught. <laughs> All right, we going low-key? Right. Yeah, going low-key. So we gotta wait for that patrol to come up. The guy on the right. I, I ain't got no bow and arrow, god dang. That's all right, I got it. There's two by the fire that we'll need to kill at the same time. Do you have a dang. fireworks? I got a bow. I got all a right. goddamn rifle. There we go. Hold on. Wait, where why is that guy not there? Someone kill him? What happened? Hold on, wait, 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 don't do anything. I ain't doing nothing. Did somebody kill the guy by the boxes? That's weird. He didn't spawn, I don't see his body either. Alright, there's two by the fire. I'll get the guy on the right. Go you ahead, Abe, you got the buff. Yeah. Alright, on three, one, two. Wait, wait, wait. Don't do it. <laughs> oh, there you go. We got it. I freaking marked on his neck. Ooh. Oh, 
Oh shit. Lee running over yeah, here. You gotta you gotta stay by him. He doesn't let us loot. Yeah, he don't let us run away or do anything. Let me get my arrows back. I know. only got 19. Let me get my arrows I got, back. I got enough. This guy, we're just going to beat. There's two horsemen. Yeah. We'll just let him pass. I've done this one a few times. And usually I'm oh. making noise and shit, but I, I hold back unless shit pops off and then I'll start shooting. Yeah, shit starts to pop off. Shoot away. Are, are they in here? No. They're in the building? They're, they just went by. What? So you just, see we're just letting them go? Oh, yeah. Oh, I see him. Yeah, we're just letting them go. Okay. They don't, they won't uh, mess anything up. Gotcha. It just takes a little bit longer to wait. Solo, there's only one. You just, you can just take them out. I mean, we could take them out. It's just more of a pain. Whatever y'all, I'm, I'm following y'all's lead. Stealthy sons of bitches out here. Look at them. Look at them, Lee. <laughs> Lee, the late, he's the least stealthy among us. Look at him, he's just running through. <laughs> At least crouch down, god dang, Lee. He gets on to you later. You don't. Yeah, he'll be like, hey. We just wait for these patrols. There's one in the back and one on the right of the barn. Uh, Let's take these guys out on the left side. You can take one of them out, but he might as well wait. Sometimes oh. this guy gets, if you do it in a, if you don't take this far right guy for some reason, he hears it somehow. Okay. Just wait for, wait for that guy. It's about when to go. That guy right there? The, yeah, the guy in the back, you can get hit now if you want. The very back patrol. Oh, back by the horse? Yeah. Oh shit, I missed. You get him? Get him? I don't know if he got killed. No, no, no. Oh, no. no. Shit. All right. It's popping. Right. Let's pop it. Man, I got the auto aim in this. I, I think I was too far. Oh, hit him. No, you just gotta hit a headshot. Like you have to get a headshot or else it won't kill him. Did he get dropped? Oh shit, I thought he got dropped. Don't die. Got that one. Okay, we got him. Follow Lee? Yeah. He'll come through here. Right here. Let's go then, Lee. Jack, can y'all see okay? It's not too dark. You want me to turn my game up? <laughs> I think I already have it maxed out, actually. It looks a little bit darker than my, my, my screen. Yeah, I don't know but why it always makes it look dark. When you go in, don't stand up. Stay creeping. Nice. Nice. Stay creeping. 
stay creeping. When you go up these stairs, you gotta be careful because sometimes this guy that's sleeping up here is not always sleeping. He's sleeping now. We got some snake oil, got dang, and a hatchet. doing fireworks and shit. You got my 12 cents on the way out. Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they wasn't going to use it. Hi there, Mary. Thank you so much. How you doing? This one's the one that we really don't want to mess up the stealth. Okay. Because it'll, it'll I got spawn. my knife out. Y'all take fun riders the whole way back. <laughs> Y'all take point then. Um, all right, so right here, there's going to be two patrol. We're just going to let wait for them to walk by. Stay back. Okay. Out of the way. So were you were you soloing these or what? Dr. Boom? Yeah. Okay. I was. Alright. I have been for the past week or so. Oh, it's your birthday tomorrow, Mary. Well, happy birthday. Right on. Alright, there's yeah, these everybody two guys everybody up here. wish uh, Mary happy birthday in the chat, please. Happy birthday, Mary. There's these two guys. Take them out. Three, two, one. There you go. <laughs> that was awesome. the guy with the lantern i'm holding up there's a guy with a lantern and then there's a guy by a lantern oh there oh, you go he's dead now okay. now what wait we gotta see the guy up on the that walks on the porch we need him to come back over to the right i mean to the left back on the porch oh okay Hi there, Dennis. Careful, there's a guy over. What, there is. Why is there missing people? <laughs> oh, I see that guy over there too, by the box. Dennis yeah, there's is. A guy over by the box. Happy too. Valentine's Day and any other right. made up oh, holiday. Is, hey, say gone. happy birthday to uh, yeah, Mary, Dennis. It's Mary's now. birthday tomorrow. Happy birthday, Mary. Happy birthday, Mary. Appreciate y'all. Okay. <laughs> we got the drunk guy. Go ahead and take the. Here, I got this. Oh shit. And. Then there's one other guy over there. Nice. And I, there's usually a guy right here and a guy over there that's not here, but oh well. Maybe, Abe, did you shoot him, maybe? Nope. He's not nah. there. Uh-oh. Want to sit on the back or something? Shit. Yeah. Here we go. <laughs> Let's go then. Good. Just watch all the blood. 
escape into the fog off in the distance like it never happened so okay i was gonna say earlier y'all there's a there's a movie on i think it's on netflix or something and it's called uh, white noise okay i ain't going nowhere i just wanted to talk to y'all about this real quick while i'm hitching a ride here uh but uh it's it's basically the exact same thing that what happened oh jeez. oh man are we getting shot at no we ran over lee ran over lee oh shit is his horse dead he killed his horse no. <laughs> yeah, <this laughs> <horse is> <laughs> hey Lee, come on man. We ain't got all day, Lee. Anyway, this movie uh is basically like it's called White Noise and it's like this weird like Shakespearean like uh I can't even explain it. It's this weird like artsy movie, but basically the whole premise of the movie is that there's this uh like toxic spill that happens as a result of a train crash or whatever and the same bill billowing cloud of smoke it's not, dude it's crazy how similar it is to what happened in ohio silky i don't know why it's white noise man <laughs> dang it silky you can't that. just ask people why they're white <laughs> <laughs> yeah 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 white noise yes, yeah Gelding's man. Hold on, we got 10 seconds. <laughs> Silky. <laughs> yeah, it's it's got Adam Driver and shit, who else? Don Cheadle. Pleasure doing business. Anyway. Pleasure doing business with you. Y'all gotta watch it, man. Oh, dollar eight and gold. Oh, dang, yep. dang. You wasn't kidding, man. You. Shit, okay. Okay. Let's get into it. So, the other one that we can do, or let's see, there's two other ones that we can do, right? There's one more that we can do. The reason um, that one will have a cooldown right now, the one we just did. Yeah. But so if you go to the other one. And then do the other one again. around that. Yeah. I yeah. And it's not Skeldon's contract. What's the other one? Don um, says there's a premium subscription to the streams. Just noticed it looking through the badges. Uh, I think that's just like being a sub, man. I, unless there's something I don't know about. Premium subscription. Oh, unless it's uh, are you looking at the links? Cause I've got like the fink, the featured uh, links that have at my Patreon and some other shits in there. If that's what you're talking about. Uh, but if it's oh, just the badges, I don't know about. Take a take a screenshot. Take a screenshot of it, Dom. You know what I really want is gifted subs, but I don't think you get that until you're uh until you're like um a uh, full-on partner or whatever oh shit whoops sorry <laughs> i didn't mean to throw that oh my god what are y'all doing y'all horsing around out here that's not what i meant to throw i thought i had my lasso out oh shit <laughs> Was that a Molotov? <laughs> what the hell? He said, what the hell? Oh, what the hell? Why did he pull out the gun? <laughs> I had my rope out. Uh oh. Oh, shit. Yeah, see. Okay, here. Y'all let me I know when you're done horsing around. We can start the next one. Why does it keep pulling my gun out? What the hell? <laughs> keep the rope out. You just, Violent ass game. You quick to shoot somebody. That's what it is. Don said, you might look into that. Seems like something I might need. Something I need. Yeah, <laughs> oh, no, I can talk. I can tie you up. Oh, shit. Oh, I can't tie you up, but I can rope you. Yeah. Why does it keep throwing dynamite out? I'm just mad because it keep, my mouse won't fucking stay gone. I'm, I'm a controller jockey over here, and it keeps on switching back to, like, my, my mouse is waking up or something. 
Oh, I think I have it on too high a precision or something. I'll have to turn down the precision on it. So it's There's like a collectible here. Oh, here we go. Shitter. Is it a collectible shit? <laughs> it's a very rare shit. <laughs> Gold plated turd. <laughs> yeah. You ain't never seen a shit like this before. Oh, yeah. I can see the shit bloom, the golden shit bloom coming out of it. I think. The hell, stupid wagon things in my way. It's like an old school rototiller. Ain't no roto to it, it's just a tiller. <laughs> One out of 14. Shit. Okay, y'all ready to start this mission up? All right, there. Since you guys want to make fun of my dress. Oh, shit. <laughs> there you go. God dang. You got, you got your got dang uh, Davy Crockett hat going on. Yeah. That's what's up. Hey, and you got like some fur pauldrons going on over there? <laughs> what is it? Yeah. <laughs> That's pretty badass. Uh, okay, hold on. Don took a screenshot of this shit. What is this? Premium subscriber badge. Earn this badge by purchasing a premium subscription. Oh, shit, man. Well, maybe uh, can I offer another tier of, of subs? If so, shit, I might start just like. Let me see. I'll have to. I'll have to research that. Thanks, Don. Okay, y'all ready? Yeah. Telegrams, Skeldings contracts. No, oh. no, no, no. Oh, it's got a cooldown on all those. A tough business. Tough business. Okay. And uh, that's the first one, good and dead. Okay, good and dead. Here we go. Your posse is too large to start this content. Oh, these are solos, huh? Is it? I think those might be sense. solos. I think we got to wait then. That's okay. It's not. I don't think it's that long. It's like skeletons contracts. Three minutes. So yeah, we could just go do a fucking anything. Yeah. Let y'all run around in circles for another three minutes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, y'all want to go? Y'all want to go? <laughs> I'm trying to rope you. <laughs> oh shit. Guys, I'm getting bullied. <laughs> hey, I got him. I got him. <laughs> yeah. Oh shit. <laughs> I got to I got to throw on on the way when you're running away from me, I think. Oh. <laughs> I think I almost got Abe on that one. <laughs> God dang rodeo clown over here. <laughs> there we go. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Got he. Man, that was tough. See how it keeps putting the mouse back in the middle, y'all? Yeah. Here, let me turn this. Oh, what the hell? There we go. The game didn't like that. Oh, shit! <laughs> no, you don't. No, you don't. Oh, my head hit a rock, man. I'm suing. Dennis said Carolina Reaper jerky is no joke. What the hell are you doing eating Carolina Reaper jerky, man? Did you, vid, hey, post a video or it didn't happen, man. Stop lying. <laughs> My controller's vibrating. Look what they did to me. Look what they did to me. Your dude's yelling. <laughs> you know, like, it doesn't yell for you, but for, for us, he's yelling. <laughs> He's like, oh, oh, oh. no, I hear him. I hear him yelling. Okay. Yeah, Don's about the only other person in here is crazy enough to probably do that. Abe, would you eat him? I don't know. I wouldn't. Abe. Maybe. Carolina Reapers. Have you ever had uh -huh. anything that spicy before? 
I have some hot sauce at my house called uh it's like Satan's ghost or something like is that. It, is it ghost pepper? Is it ghost pepper salsa? It's ghost peppers, yeah. It's oh, ghost, shit. Ghost then, then you you could probably handle it then. Ghost peppers are the worst. That shit is hot, bro. Yeah, ghost peppers are no joke, dude. I had I had uh some ghost pepper or something or other or whatever, and I was at I was at uh back when I worked at the, the pot farm out here or whatever, and uh man dude, I was messed up. That messed me up for like a month, man. I had to like I had like <laughs> all kinds of digestive issues and shit. I, I, I was done. I just put a little dab. I just put a little dab in my nudes. Oh, there you go. My cup of nudes. Yeah. That shit's so good in there. Make them get that extra spice. Yep. Don said, uh, oh, he said, cat, cat got me some for Valentine's. He said, company called Ratch. Hey, don't be just spon I'm not sponsored by this motherfucker. Who? It's really good, but pretty hot. Okay. <laughs> I ain't saying their name. They could sponsor me, though. <laughs> buy one of their bottles and then make a ugc Except, send them send it to the brand yeah i got it that's that's what i got well i gotta grow my audience really before i can start courting these fools no some of these companies don't even want popular people they really? just want user generated content yeah okay well shit maybe so what are you saying like just, just make a video just make for the them? video and then send it to them yeah okay Say, hey this is what i got for you you like, want to sponsor me yeah hook it up you want to send me a check you, hey, can you, use my give, video. Use my you video. can use give, my video. Give me some money. You, you can take they don't put it. They don't want you to put it on your page. They want you. They want to put it on their page. Oh, I got you. Yeah. So they're not looking for big. I need big to start. Names. I need to start doing that. I got to start looking for companies that that let me make videos for them. They're looking for men. So. Yeah, they're looking for folks to do that shit. No, they're looking for men. Oh, for what? What was mm -hmm. it? Most brands are looking for men creator, like men creators that aren't oh, popular. Oh, I got you. Oh, I see. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Two men in a van. <laughs> you what? Okay, so uh There's two dope boys in a Cadillac. Okay, so we can do in bad faith or sow and reap. Which one should we do? In bad faith Hold is on the on one where we gotta be in two spots or we gotta do two different things on one of them anyway. Uh you haven't done either one of them. You haven't done either one? No. Okay, well, let's do in bad faith. The The thing is, I think we should just uh, focus on one at a time. At least that was the way that it worked out for us That that the times that I've done it. We'll see how it goes. Instead of trying to split up. Yeah, because if you, if you split up, because number one, you don't have the auto aim. So, and we got to shoot a bunch of fools out there. And uh, the one of them, one of them is easy. So I'll look at the map when we start it up. And one of them, you just got to go pick her up and not get seen by the cops and then run her out of town, wherever the waypoint is. And then the other one, you got to go in there, you know, guns a blazing and then shoot everybody and then and then bring them to the location. So there's two people, basically, you got to go rope up and get. But the second one, it's a whole firefight. So. So actually, let's start with the, the, the hard, the harder one first. Now that I'm thinking about it, because that way, if we die, we can just go right back to that instead of having to redo everything. So the the one where we gotta do the the gunfight is right over here. I start at the checkpoint. It doesn't really matter. You won't like lose yours. I don't know if there is a checkpoint. At least. There will be. There's gotta be. I threw the waypoint, but it should. There we go. It's taking us to the other way. It's just taking us roundabout because we went the other direction. Don't go in there, guns blazing just yet, man. Wait till we get there. I got my mini gun. Just kidding. <laughs> I was gonna say, man, it's gonna be easy then. This guy's over here all padded up, all kinds of tactical gear. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, this is it right here, man. This is it. So oh, we we can run in from any one of these sides. 
What the hell? Are they shooting at you already? Yeah, he just started shooting at me for no reason. Yeah, yeah we're going in. Got that mouse. All right, so we got to go in here and find this fool. I need my sniper rifle. I'm getting rid of the waypoint just so that doesn't confuse us. Oh shit, you got me. Oh damn, I didn't even see that fool. Shit, you ran him. Oh shit, that's not that was shit. Oh damn, he got me. I'm downed, but I'm not dead yet. I got you, I got you. I was gonna say, watch out. <laughs> shit. Uh, let me see if I can get my cover, core. Yeah, let me see if I can get my cores fixed. Okay, here we go. Take uh, tonics if you need. These guys hurt. Yeah, just trying to get my, my cores back up real quick, too. What's going on, Dalton? How the heck are you? Oh, did you I kill the wrong guy? You shot the guy, oh, huh? Oh, shit. <laughs> you gotta watch out. He's right. he, that's easy to do. I, I've done that. Oh, I have played man. this one, actually. Retry checkpoint. We'll try and see where that puts us. I think we're just gonna start right back at the beginning, but all we did was right over there, so. You mean to tell me that guy without a gun wasn't the guy I was supposed to kill? <laughs> <laughs> oh, what the hell? How'd it put us over here? What the hell? Where are we at? Well, okay. Let's go this way. Might be better to run up on foot. I don't know. <laughs> oh, my horse. Yeah, no, it's still a ways away. <laughs> okay. Freaking horse, come on. Don said, do a quick video of eating a piece of it and send it to the cool kids chat. Or put it in the Discord. The cool kids chat. Here. Y'all need to oh, quit yeah. with that and post it to the goddamn Discord. <laughs> My horse is too slow. I'm you just, just run on foot? I see you. Mm -hmm. Barely mm. catching up to you. Here. You guys tired. Oops. Alright, we about hey, here. You not going on? I'm not going on. This is about it right here anyway, y'all. Oh, yeah. Is it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thanks for the ride. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to slice all these guys up now. Uh, Let's just fucking. All right, let's do it. Yeah, you could stealth them. You could. Well, no, not no more. You can't. <laughs> Punk. Look, I got served. It's going down. Oh shoot! Say hello to Jesus for me. <laughs> I heard that. I was like, oh wow. Jeez. You know Jesus? <laughs> Why are these guys? Slice, slice, slice. Oh no, I'm down. All right, hold on, hold on. I can't slice them. Oh my god, I can't. There's like, the... there's gonna be cops coming now. There's a bunch Fuck. of guys. There's a bunch of guys here, man. Hold on, shit. Dang it. I got him. Never mind. Okay, I got a up. Nice. Thank you. Where the hell? All right, I'm using the gun now. Take, uh, uh, shit. tonics if you need. Yeah, I was gonna say, you got tonics, Abe? Yeah. Here you are. I think. What did I eat? <laughs> there we go. Some <laughs> kidney beans. I know a couple of Jesus's, but I don't know no Jesus. More kidney beans. <laughs> Oh, salmon beef. Cool kids ain't cool here. no more. <laughs> Look at There you go. Careful, though. I'm all fooled up now. Yeah, which one Which one of these fools can't we not shoot? Got nothing? He's in a black jacket. 
And he has his hands up. He ain't got no gun, right? No. Yeah, they all have guns, don't they? Oh, here, oh, he, this he last one, last one, last one. It's him right here. Oh, he didn't have a gun last Oh, shit, time. there is one more back there shooting. Oh. What the hell one is it? They're gonna kill me. I'm just gonna tackle one of these fools. It's that guy right there. Okay. <laughs> yep. No, I'm, I'm not trying to beat him up. Dismiss. Ah, what the hell? <laughs> I gotta tie his ass up. Yeah. Are you thick? Jesus. Okay. So we'll run this fool in. I'll try not to die. And then, uh. Dang, where's Christine in? Or what, what the hell is my horse name over here? <laughs> Good looking. Here, I'm gonna throw him on your horse. Here. All right, go ahead to the waypoint. We'll follow you. Oh, this is my horse. What the hell? Why did this guy come out on here? Uh, it's. Do you have a. It's a separate setting on what horse to use on missions. Oh. It's not your default. You have to change that to whatever you want. Okay, let's run it in, god dang. No, oh, don't we have to get the other one? Yeah, but uh, we don't have to do them both at the same time. Uh oh. Th this one was the hard one, the other one's pretty easy. So we'll get this one taken in, and then that way we're in the clear. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. Oh, what the hell? Why is it telling us to go this way? Is your waypoint still going that way? Okay. It doesn't have a mine doesn't have a waypoint. Mine oh, does. Cause he got there already. Okay. So now now yeah, the other one is uh back over here. Wait, wait. And to the drop off. Where is the drop off? Oh here, yeah. Yeah, you got you should have him there already. Yeah, he's there. Okay, I set a waypoint, and uh, once we get over here, we just got to find her. She's, she's going to be just walking around one of those streets. So if you see her, uh, we can grab her, but uh, you kind of want to make sure that ain't no cops around. Can so I we stab don't... her? <laughs> nah, oh. she got to live. Oh, okay, you can't stab her? <laughs> we can stab everyone else, all the witnesses. Yeah. That there's a nebulae going to be, probably. Oh, I got Yeah, I got to watch that show, Red Sky. You, you, you keep on trying to put me up on it. I see you posting about it. What show? It's called Warrior. Mm. I, heard of it. I watched. Um, it's about a kung fu master or something. Oh, I forget the name of it. Damn it. Where you they separate uh, your work life from your off work life? Severance. Oh, I haven't seen Third. that. That's pretty crazy. So basically, Oops. you're. On work self, you're at work self. All they know is working, and you never know working. Uh, it's kind of like putting yourself in a prison, right? Oh, it's just this the lady. I don't think that's the lady. The search area is over here. Wow. Oh. Yeah, so get to the search area, and then she should be walking around. Sometimes she is walking around just right here. It says, uh, recruiting four people, so she's probably going to be saying something to recruit people. They're giving a speech or something. Yeah, I'm not sure. She's just walking around. <laughs> wow. Yeah, Red Sky, definitely don't do that. looking around on this side she's right here you found her okay yeah just put her on a horse and run her out of there if we get cops on us just keep riding I'm gonna knock her out. 
What happened? Oh, what? I killed her. He stomped her out like American History X. Oh. <laughs> I was trying to Another knock gap. her out. Oh, Sorry shit. about that. Uh, let's try checkpoint, see if that does anything. I, I think to... it's going to probably not do much. I wanted her to be knocked out so she didn't yell. <laughs> he stomped her out like American History X. <laughs> Whoopsie daisy. Yep, now we got to go back and do the other one. Nah. Yep. And that, and. No, we do not. Yeah, we oh do. Oh my god. Yep, this is one yeah, of the tougher definitely. ones. Sorry about that. I thought it was like. I always knock out the bounties. Yep. So they don't escape. You're good. You're good. This gives us practice. <laughs> I've never killed somebody with one kick. It was a stomp. Just ran well, up and stomped her okay. out. <laughs> it she, was a stomp. But... She was put out. God. Okay, same plan as before. Make sure you got some uh, some goodies ready to eat when you get shot up. We probably more or less know the drill by now, but still want to be careful. We want to do the silent. You could try can. it. You could try it. But hello. You gotta die. I kill me. Oh no, no. Oh, that ain't good. That ain't good. What? <laughs> Abe died. <laughs> oh shit. Everybody running out of here. Why are we getting so many witnesses? Oh, no. Oh shit. What? All kinds of witnesses and shit now. I know. But it looks like they went away. One of the levels went away. Where did it? Where did it? Where did it? Got done. Around this way. Oh! <laughs> he got swarmed up. Abe must be on the other side. Oh shit. Guy, it's know. hard to tell who's who, isn't it? Man, it's hard to tell, man. Oh, I see who it is. I got it, I got it. Oh shit, the law's here. I see him, I see him. Well, let's just, let's just get, rope him up and get him out of here. Can. Alright, I'm getting him out. No! Fuck, I almost did it again. <laughs> I accidentally kicked him. Luckily, <laughs> one kick didn't do it. Okay, let's just get up out of here. You got him? Yeah, I got him, but watch out, the log's coming. Shit, man. God dang it. Where the hell my horse at? Fuck. I'm right behind you. Alright. Shit, he's trying to run up right now. Where to put you at, Abe? Oh. 
Hey, but if you AFK, just keep your dude out of trouble and uh, just try to touch the controller every five minutes or something so you don't get timed out. Actually, I don't, I don't know if that'll matter. We'll have 13 minutes, I think. Yeah. So we got 13 minutes to finish the mission. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Which we should be able to do. Okay. Yeah, and this one, it's pretty easy. We just got to not kill her. <laughs> <laughs> no stomping. And don't die. We can't die or get or kill anything. Or well, yeah, you know what I mean. <laughs> yeah. We're heading over to the search area, and this lady should just be out walking around somewhere. I'm gonna pick her up and run her back to the safe house. Found her. Wow, that was quick. <laughs> Hi there. Don't mind me. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, shit. That was funny as hell. Oh, my God. Here, let me just I get this dynamite real fast. Jesus. This is bad. Oh, shit. Move, move. My bad. Oh, shit. He ain't dead. He ain't even dead. What the fuck? Shot that fool in the head. All right, let's go. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Or we do something else crazy. <laughs> I almost ran up with her on some dynamite. Yeah, I seen that. I was like, what, what are you doing with the dynamite? I'm gonna blow this lady up. Surprised we didn't get no attention shooting that fella. You didn't get any witnesses? No, nothing. It was weird. I didn't even kill him, too. He just ran off, like went home. Dude, if I sneeze in St. Denise, I have yeah. people telling on me. That's why I don't understand. Okay. Bring her inside and I think we're done. Yeah. Oh, what the? You see that? It said crime reported right there at the end, like we were about to get. <laughs> that was crazy. Oh. We're getting ran up on. Oh, oh. my screen, we're getting ran oh, okay, up on. Okay. Oh, yeah, you're good. Okay, we are. I'm just wasting ammo over here, I think. Shit. We're supposed to get on the wagon. Okay, okay. Wait, wait. Yeah, yep, yep. Go ahead, go ahead. Here are we rolling out. We only got one team left, so hopefully they follow us. <laughs> they go after eight. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm They're saying. Them. If they go They're after like eight, we're about to die. We was done, man. Me too. All right, get me there, man. Get me there. Oh, 
shit, this is a narrow ass bridge. Good thing nobody was on it. Yep, here comes somebody. There they go. Oh shit. I think. <laughs> Little hairpin right there. Wanted dead or alive. Don't die, eh? I'm not gonna die, brother. <laughs> we was worried about you back there. Yeah, I had somebody come in. I figured. Talking about cards. Heck yeah. What they got? They didn't end up getting anything because I didn't have what they wanted, but. Oh, I see. That happens sometimes. It's all good. Yeah. Where the hell am I? Where's my horse? Well now, you made his bitch. Come here. They all bleed the same. My horse is running away from me. He's gonna say, do we run it in? There it is. Oh, oh, doesn't matter. Get our dollar eight in gold. Man, that's Wait, like boy. ten times what you normally get. Three times, but we did it so slow. <laughs> yeah, no shit. That other one was way faster. Yeah. What up? Well, we all <laughs> we also <laughs> died a few times. I'm gonna jump off y'all, so I don't hold right. y'all up. Okay, no worries. All right, peace out. All right, take care, Abe. What the hell? Okay, just spawned me out in the middle of nowhere. I found you. <laughs> yep. I'm not hard to find. Okay. Now what do you want to do? Well, let's see. Uh, let's go. Let's go back to camp and see if we can't do a delivery. I don't know if Crips is going to be ready, but let's uh, fast travel. Where's the closest fast travel at? We're at maybe uh, Rhodes or Emerald. They're both pretty close. Or or yeah, where's this other one in the in the La Grass? Over here somewhere. It's like over here somewhere. Yes. Yeah, they're all about the same. Yeah. We're like right in the middle. There's a stable here if you need one. Okay. Back on the road. You having pizza tonight? That sounds good. I'm having some skitty. So I'm probably not going to do a live stream tonight, but uh, the plan is to start a little bit earlier in the day now that I got this new format worked out. Uh, I got a real late start today, but hopefully I'll get started around noon. And then we're just going to do a long stream every day, or longer stream. So I might be doing mukbangs like I used to. And we'll just kind of, it'll be a very freeform stream. Whatever the hell we want to play, whatever the hell we want to do, whatever the hell we want to talk about. Dollar bounty. A dollar bounty. <laughs> what did you we even do? <laughs> I didn't even do nothing. Four dollars to camp? That ain't bad.
Yeah, uh, yeah, your time. That sounds about right, Red Sky. Yeah, I'm gonna try to get started around noon. That's my usual start time for my for my first stream of the day or whatever. Usually around around that time, and then we'll just keep it going, have a good time, you know, and uh, bullshit, hang out, talk about what's going on in the world, play a couple different games or whatever. Whatever we're feeling. I want to play that got dang new Harry Potter game, but I'm Let's see if I can't get me a copy. <laughs> Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Okay, uh, let's check in with Crypt real fast. Oh shit, he ain't done nothing, man. <laughs> he ain't done a goddamn thing. Whatever, shit. Yeah, I really don't think he's done. Well, he, I mean, he's done a little bit, but really nothing. Dang, Crips, I thought you'd been up to the line by now. Slow. He is slow. I'll take some of the stew again. Yeah. I'm going to go with uh, some skeddy. I'm probably going to have uh, maybe some cucumber slices and uh, some Texas toast and put a little Parmesan on it. You know what I mean? I like to have uh, just like peas or whatever with my with my skeddy. But I ain't got none. <laughs> so... Um, so yeah, I probably, I think I'm probably going to try to wrap it up for today. Um, I don't know. Uh, I want to check before I, before I bounce out there, I want to check and see what the hell's going on in the world. Little, we'll check for some updates. I want to see what, what everybody's talking about on Twitter or whatever. Hold on. And, uh, uh, Dr. Boom, thank you for jumping in and playing. You were, you were already playing, huh? I was already playing. <laughs> right on. Um, let's see. Let me refresh this. Yeah, I try, I try to stay up on everything that's going on. Uh, anything hit your radar that, that was uh, newsworthy or that caught your attention? Mm, Just, not besides the stuff that you already talked about. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I was just trying to, I was trying to uh, stay, oh, here, okay, Ohio, I guess, is trending now. It wasn't, before it wasn't, or at least I don't think it was. Now it looks like everybody's talking about it. Seymour Hirsch came out with an article um, talking about how the U.S. blew up the Nord Stream 2 pipeline. I heard about that, too, the pipeline. Uh, mm -hmm. wh where was that at, the Nord Stream pipeline? I keep hearing about it. It was... Between um, it connected Russia and Germany, I believe. Oh, between Russia and Germany. So fucking Ukraine, right or no? no. no? U.S. No, I mean like it isn't. I thought Ukraine was between. I, I'm not. I'm not good with the geography on that. That part of the the plan. Ukraine's to the west of Russia. Right. And Germany is to the southwest, I guess. Okay. But it doesn't run through Ukraine, is what you're saying? I don't think so, no. Okay. It runs through some waters. It was an underwater pipeline. Oh, shit, okay. So, yeah, and then, and then so they did an article talking about how the U.S. might have done that, or, like, U.S. It, interests? Well, it, it, it described to detail, like, who did it, like, what they talked about and stuff like that. Oh, really? So... It was, um, according to his article, it was Norway in the U.S. Norway in the U.S., huh? Yeah. So, I don't know if y'all seen these images, but this is of the Ohio incident. And look at that shit. It, that, dude, I'm telling you, if you go, if you go uh, look at the movie uh, White Noise, the whole premise of the movie is about this, dude. It's so fucking weird. It's so surreal. Just thinking about it, it's like, man. Hi there, Donna. Is Donna in here still? I didn't see her comment. All right, so I'm looking at a map. There's water all the way. It's a completely underwater pipeline, pipe, pretty much. 
from Russia to Germany. Okay. And it's the Nord Stream pipeline. And is was yeah. this was this already carrying fuel? Hold on, I don't want to get people confused. We're looking at images of Ohio, but he's talking about the Nord Stream pipeline, which is a separate thing, y'all. Carrying uh, natural gas. Uh, let me let me look up. Actually, let's Please. go. Hold on, I'm gonna bring up another uh, window, and then I'll search. Shit, how the, how the hell? Oh, here, let's go. Let's just type in Nord Stream. Nord. Whoops, shit. No, I'm not trying to tweet. God dang it. <laughs> I'm about to just tweet it out. Uh, Nord Stream. There we go. Nord Stream sabotage. Okay. Uh, Nord Stream. Let's see. Antiwar.com says uh, Russia says NATO should hold emergency summit over Nord Stream sabotage. Journalist Seymour Hirsch. That's the one you're talking about, right? Mm-hmm. Reported that President Biden authorized the bombing of the pipelines by Dave DeCamp. Dang, that is scathing. Mm-hmm. Seymour Hirsch is a investigative journalist. Reg- he's like legendary. He okay broke like uh, My Lai massacre in Vietnam. Oh Milai wow! Massacre. Okay. Uh, the Abu Ghraib prisoners um, torturing oh. photos. Okay. Um, he covered Watergate. He didn't break Watergate, but he covered it for the New York Times yeah. during the time of Watergate. Like he's not some chump. Right, right, you know? right. This is this is a this is a thoroughbred journalist or whatever is what you're saying. Yeah. So, uh, okay. So just so just so uh, y'all are we get this fully clarified here. So this. This pipeline is, uh, uh, oh, basically, it's but be- is it be- it's between Germany and Russia, yeah. Yes. Okay, and it's it mostly runs underwater, and so apparently this uh, investigative journalist uh, Seymour Hirsch, legendary Seymour, I guess, and uh, he basically blew the whistle on this or whatever, not bl- whistle blew, but reported on it his his article, I guess. So yeah, it says. President Biden authorized the bombing of the pipelines. That's crazy. And do they say? Does he say why? Like, does it? Do they go into like why and who who benefited and who profited off of that or whatever? Um, Russia. That was one of Russia's biggest um, ways of keeping Germany and thus NATO kind of in check. You know, because they rely on them for natural gas. I see. Right. So their hands are kind of tied a little bit because they rely so heavily on Russian gas. I see. And um, this screwed over, um, screwed over our allies in Europe. Yeah. And fucked over Russia. So, now Germany is getting a lot of gas from us. Well, and it's instead. screwed. It's also an ecological disaster, ain't it? I mean, if it's carrying oil and it's in the ocean. It's not oil. I think it's natural gas. So I don't think oh. it's okay. You know, it'll get released in the air. I'm sure it's not great, but it's less. It's not like a gas. Okay. I mean, it's not like oil where it's the cleanup and. So I yeah, ecologically unclear, a, unclear ecologically, yeah. I guess at this point. Yeah. But yeah, yeah, that's still crazy. So yeah, it basically screwed everybody over. So how did the U.S. benefit from that then? Just because it, it screwed Russia over, screwed. It made Germany and change to our natural gas suppliers. I see. So, so now our natural gas is booming. I selling see. it to um, Germany. Okay. So in Europe. This is that shady shit, man. That, that they don't really want to talk about. They don't want to put this into the news. You know, in the news cycle, because this is like. Uh, you know, this is like the dirt of like our geopolitics. Basically, is like it, it, behind every international decision, there's always like this like underlying business deal, or you know, somebody's pockets getting lined. Like you, you know, we talked about the war profiteers earlier, but you know, this is usually why the shit happens. I mean, this goes in hand in glove with the war prof- profiteers, though. Yeah, because it helps them out too. So, uh, 
So yeah, tangentially, or I guess they're not they're not they're not uh, connected in any way really. But th- I guess if you consider that an ecological disaster, um, I don't know. I guess there's not really any comparison. But I just want to uh, segue back over to this other Ohio thing because people are barely starting to talk about it now, and uh, it looks like it's trending on Twitter now. So uh, I'm sure most of y'all probably have heard about it then by now. Uh, but these are some of the images coming out of here. Um. This is, okay, where is this? Oh, yeah, this is, okay, so this is where it happened. When I was looking at the wind, because I was looking at a wind map, and it was actually showing that it was blowing towards Pennsylvania, out that way, and then south, maybe. But the winds have probably changed up since then, and they probably, this was last night, and I think this happened like three, I want to say three or four days ago. Yeah. February. There's tw- like dead fish in the water now. There's uh, chickens, people's chickens are di- are dying. Yeah, um, and uh, there's a video. I'm 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 hoping that we can see this video. There's a video that I do posted to TikTok where they're talking about this. Um, yeah, Nancy says I didn't hear about it until last night. Yeah, we that's when I learned about it. We were we were looking at it last night, going, "What the hell is this?" You know. Um, but here, let's play this one. They burn off in East Palestine. Hold on. So massive train derails, uh, flames up in the sky in Ohio. Evacuation order was in place for anyone within a mile radius, but apparently this has it's devastating the environment. Like I think what they say, like like a fifty mile radius or hundred mile radius or some shit, depending on how far if it's downwind or whatever. Yeah, I think they let people back in close by now. Yeah, and there was I, I saw some posts about people who got let back. And they were, they could still smell the chemicals in the air. And like people were showing, there's a, there, I seen some images of people's cars where like, uh, like acid rain. <laughs> I don't know how far away this was, but, and I, you know, it's, it's hard to say what's connecting what isn't because it's all just kind of, you know, culminating on social media as far as the different pieces of information that you get. But, uh, not good, man. And people's pets have died. Yeah. Nancy said, so, uh, these are these are showing like clouds. This was after. This is the fucking shit. The fucking shit they burn off in East Palestine. This is not fucking. I have a friend that's up by Columbus. He said that yeah. he's. They say that they're fine. That he's in the clear, but. Yeah. I don't know, man. Yeah, I mean, it, when when they don't when it doesn't really even hit the mainstream news and they don't really talk about it and it's not being addressed like federally in any kind of like large preventative way, like I mean. There's a lot of red flags around how this was handled and, and how it was communicated to the public. I know people locally, obviously, were very much informed, you know, for the most part. But I, the the way that it played out, I don't know, man. And I wouldn't feel safe being being downwind of it or downstream of it or, you know, anything else in that area. I'd be pissed, man. The railroad operator also is um, working on removing legislation like they had it downgraded where this wasn't considered hazardous material right. anymore and there's a lot of shady ass shit like that going on too yeah so there was the deregulation that happened uh supposedly under trump right and then there was the whole union you know fiasco where they didn't let they didn't let the rail yard workers strike or what or what was the deal with that yeah so the rail workers wanted to strike and Congress has a the ability since um, a long time ago in our history when there was railroad strikes, they yeah. made a law where they can basically tell them that they aren't allowed to strike. Which is total bullshit, man. That's Which that, is total bullshit. Like every, I don't, I don't care where you work, you you should be able to strike. I don't, you know, what I mean, it shouldn't matter. That should be a protected right anywhere in America. I mean. If you don't have the right to refuse to work, doesn't that make you what? <laughs> yeah, exactly. You know? Exactly. Yeah. What and are you? <laughs> yeah. What does that make you? It, are it, you free? <laughs> right. Yeah. See, then that and that's the thing is like and and from what I understand the 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 rail workers were saying for a long time like, "Hey, you know, if things if y'all don't pay attention to what's happening here, we're going to have shit like this happen." Like this was a part of their warning was like their you, stuff was about safety measures and stuff like that. Yeah, like you, they're they're they used to have a, like I guess like it was like three minutes or something where they could uh, inspect a car or something, right? And then now 
they supposedly they have like 90 seconds or something like that and i don't know exactly how this plays out or under what like what exactly they're 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 looking to find you know when they're inspecting the cars but um you know all around if you don't have you know workers that are fully supported you know both you know in terms of like their compensation for the work and also in terms of being able to employ enough people to be able to like make sure you know that all of the work is being handled properly that's when you have accidents like this and that's crazy man like there is like there's like lives that were that are going to be ruined i mean and who knows how long this is gonna i don't know man like this it just doesn't sound good so Railroad company made 12 billion dollars i believe it was last year and their workers don't have paid sick uh paid sick leave nor is it it's norfolk southern right uh that sounds right and uh they're owned by like uh like the shadiest motherfuckers on wall street that you can think of i can't remember the name i think it's blackrock and uh they're like the major shareholders of of them anyway um you know the the same the same folks that you see basically behind every goddamn big business um but yeah like Ohio cops arrest national news reporter for reporting the truth. This was this was like when it was breaking though. Like, and this is I think this is partially why nobody heard about this because, and I don't know. It may be because they got too close and they didn't want him, you know, near. I don't know. They said that it was because that he was too loud <laughs> while he was doing his reporting. <laughs> okay, <laughs> okay. So and the guy, wait. like, there's a video of him getting arrested. Like, what? yeah. But what led up to it is um. That's what they said is that they he was being too loud. You have freedom of speech as long as you shut the fuck up. <laughs> I think he was in the back, probably doing like one of those, you know, live update type things. Yeah, and and like just he was just kind of like disrupting the order of business or something. I guess. But still, like it's yeah, a bad look. It is. Okay, so it says right here, according to Norfolk Southern Railroad, uh, the controlled releases process involved the burning of rail cars, chemicals, which release fumes in the air that can be deadly if inhaled. Based on current weather patterns and expected flow of the smoke and fumes, anyone who remains in the red affected area is facing grave danger of death. And I don't know, this must have been right after the incident. Anyone who remains in the yellow impacted area is at high risk of severe injury, including skin burns and serious lung damage. And and it's also the the thing to consider here too is that if you breathe this shit in, if you don't die, you're gonna die because it's it's like the worst carcinogens in the world or whatever, you know. Mm -hmm. And they didn't this uh, the fire starts because they lit it on fire. Yeah, exactly. Well, because because they had they had to make a decision, right? Like it was either gonna explode, or right. they or they had to do a controlled burn on it, and they decided to do a controlled burn, if I'm not mistaken, but. Uh, obviously there wasn't anything controlled about it. <laughs> I don't know why they say, con you know, you can't do a controlled burn on, on, you know, like hundreds of thousands or however many thousands of gallons of, uh, chemical it was. There's no such thing as a controlled burn in that regard. It's like, you can't contain the smoke or anything. You can't like, it's not like if you're burning grass on the side of a highway, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, Hey, we're doing a controlled burn over here. Like is is I don't understand how they can call it a controlled burn. Meaning that the air and water are safe. Residents say they can still smell chlorine. They can. Residents said they can still smell chlorine. They've complained about their eyes watering when they go outside, and then they, they they're showing like like fish dying, and I don't know. People have uh, there was a video of a guy that was talking about his pet that died while he was holding another one of his pets. I don't know. Complained about their eyes watering when they go outside, and one woman says the noxious air kills her chickens. The one lady said that the her I guess her chickens died as a result. Out of nowhere, he just this guy right here. Really hard and just shut down and I think there was a very other derailment too that didn't get as much as attention. It was like an oil all these fucking car. Cars. I'm not it's so there, it's not it, as it's not as dangerous okay. though. That's why. There's a I video right this. here. Uh, so um. Uh, sorry, I, I didn't mean to cut you off. So there's a there was another one that happened. Is that what you're saying? No, go on. Well, yeah, uh, it was just an oil tanker or something, though. They had in this video. They have. Uh, I think this was right after the incident when the smoke was billowing through, and uh, it's showing like a bunch of crows like flying away from the the smoke, and there's like a huge swarm of them. I don't know. Ten miles of East Palestine. 
that's the guy cussing no 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 but i got that i got that though <laughs> where he was all pissed off and he's like this is the fucking shit that they were burning off in east palestine or whatever yeah, yeah. he was pissed i don't blame him man i'd be pissed too i don't blame him i feel him dude i would i would have been so pissed and i was i was like i was like where the fuck did this happen at when i first heard about it i was like i don't need none of this shit and we've got chemical we've all ugh, dude i'm by i'm by hanford out here and like they've got uh uh, ch1 or whatever the hell they're called the chemical company out here and they they, they always crazy, have dude. they got these companies man that are basically they can do whatever the fuck they want hanford's nuts oh dude don't even don't get me started people know about that don't even get me started man hanford is a whole other fucking can of worms man it's like next level fucking ecological disaster <laughs> it's like there's nothing no comparison i mean it's yeah but it, whatever you know it's I don't know. I mean, uh, that that's like a whole topic for a whole nother day, but you have not evacuated. Please leave the area. I don't think enough people know about it though. About Hanford. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, it's, well, it's supposed to be, that was the end of that video, but it, uh, Hanford's Hanford is essentially, you know, it's labeled as a cleanup site, right? And, uh, a storage site for nuclear waste. And, uh, they've, uh, they've just got, I think, just started, restarted a, uh, what's it called? Uh, what the hell's the name of that thing? It's like a glassification. They they turn, like, these uh, the waste into um, s some kind of, like, glass or some shit, and then they, they store those. Um, mm -hmm. Anyway, but, yeah, we'll have to talk about that another day. Um, but I just wanted to catch up on this. This was the, this was the guy. Here we go. Let's watch this one. Ohio was a bigger deal than they said. At last Wednesday's press conference with the governor, a reporter asked what chemicals were of concern, and this is what the representative from the railroad said. This is a TikTok. Obviously, the vinyl chloride. That can't hear it. Vinyl chloride. Vinyl chloride. Burned, and then uh, a little bit of lube oil, non-hazardous. non, -has non -has lube oil, a little bit. A little bit of non-hazardous lube oil and butyl, what did he say? Butyl, butyl. non has lube oil, a little bit. Butyl acrylate. Butyl acrylate. A lot of what we're uh, gathering. Butyl act. So today, the 12th, four days later, the EPA released the manifest sent to them yesterday from Norfolk Southern Railroad. This document's been downloaded directly from the so, EPA's website from the link in my bio. I brought up this non has lube oil before because just because it's non hazardous doesn't mean that it's okay to spill it into the ground. Okay, so he says just because it's non hazardous lube oil doesn't mean that it's okay to spill it into the ground. And the EPA is releasing information now. Uh, but this guy, I don't know who this guy is. I'm trying to, nobody, is this, does this link to his TikTok or they reposted this? I think they reposted this. Um, but this guy, if you find this guy's videos on TikTok, yeah, Don, Don was asking Hanford nuclear site. Yeah, that's what it is, Don. I live right by there. That's where we live at is, is, uh, Tri-Cities, which is, uh, basically, you know, we're connected. Hanford, Hanford is uh, over by Richland. And then uh, I, we live in Kennewick, and then there's Pasco. That's the Tri-Cities right there. But Hanford is technically considered a part of, I don't know, it's it's separate because it's its own, like, government site out there, but it's kind of by Richland, West Richland or whatever out that way anyway. But uh, this was the guy on TikTok that was blowing the whistle, or, you know, he was really giving out good information. Uh, so if you can find him, <clears throat> you'll probably get the most up-to-date uh, relevant information. So he said a little bit. Well, their train manifests here says they lost almost two full loads. These classes of train cars can carry up to 30,000 gallons. I have another video posted right before this that went into more things that were listed on this list but never previously mentioned. So we know that there have been One tens of, of thousands of gallons in, uh, of petroleum World oil War spilled. One the question is, as a... yeah, I, I was reading about that too. Or it was a, yeah, it was a, it was a chemical warfare weapon in World War One. Yeah. Yeah. So. I mean, it's obviously not good shit, super toxic and hazardous and all that. Uh, now, what they deem, like he said, what they deem hazardous versus what can be safely, you know, just dumped into the ground, uh, there's, it's a different distinction. So just because it's not hazardous doesn't mean that it's good for the earth <laughs> or good for the ecology and, and the people and animals and everything, you know. How much of it burned? We also know that they've been using back trucks and skimmers to collect more material. But how much have they caught? One gallon of petroleum oil can pollute up to one million gallons of water. It's going to be really important for us to find out exactly what those petroleum oils were. 
Because most petroleum oils have additives added to them that That's modify true. certain he said characteristics they have additives. of the product. There are tons of different chemicals that are used for this purpose, but some of them are those forever chemicals, PFAS, that you've heard. Some of them are forever chemicals, the PFAS and the PFOS. Those are the ones that uh, the companies got in trouble for that were uh, like the Teflon pans and shit like that that were lined with the forever chemicals, and then people were getting them into their bodies because I'm shit. I, I probably had that shit. I mean, I, I've eaten off of all kinds of different, <laughs> you know, cooked on different all kinds of things over the years. So heard about. They don't break down in nature, and they can be harmful to humans even in very small amounts. Yeah. Cause developmental issues, developmental issues, issues, cancer. Cancer. What this document shows us is there's kind of three levels to this disaster. There was the initial fire, the intentional okay, initial fire, fire to prevent the explosion of the vinyl fire, tanks, then an oil spill. And then an oil spill. <laughs> oh, man. So three phases to the to the accident and how it went all, all went down. Um, and let's see. Uh, okay, this person's just kind of going off saying, while you're looking at UFOs and balloons, Pulitzer Prize winning journalist uh, Seymour Hersh uh, has accused Joe Biden and the CIA of sabotaging Nord Stream Pipeline in explicit detail and a uh, 50-car train derailment in East Palestine, Ohio that the EPA control burned, <laughs> and they put that in uh, quotations. Anyway, uh, this is what I've been kind of following and, and seeing what the hell's going on in the world, y'all. Uh, so I plan on going live again uh, tomorrow. We can talk about all this shit and more. Um, but I just kind of wanted to dip into that and see what the hell was going on in the world real quick before I, I log out today. Anyway, I want to thank you guys for hanging out. And, uh, yeah, come back tomorrow. We'll hang out some more. We'll play some different games, uh, bullshit and all that. I'll try to get an earlier start. And uh, this time uh, we'll we'll be doing longer live streams during the daytime. That way it gives me some time to post clips and do some other shit in the evenings as well as get ready for the next day. So anyway, I appreciate you guys. Thank you so much. Peace, peace, peace. Take care now.